So this is sort of my method, my approach for using a compressor. Uh, I'm going to grab the threshold and bring it all the way down to minus 36. I'm going to grab the uh, the ratio and bring it all the way up. So the threshold, that's where the compressor is going to start reacting. Uh, right now it's at minus 36. So for any sounds that go above minus 36, the compressor will react. Uh, the ratio is how much compression is going to happen. So right now you see 2 to 1. So for every 2 dB I go over the threshold, the output will be 1. If I have it set to 4 to 1, just like you would think, for every 4 dB I go over the threshold, the output will be 1. Uh, I like to set it on infinity. I'm not going to leave it on that, but this is, uh, again, a process that I go through when I'm setting up a compressor. I never find that the same settings uh, will apply. Um, even if I'm using the same sounds, it just depends on on other aspects uh, of what's going on in the track. So it's typically something that I, I it's a very quick process, but I always go through it. Uh, and it really helps um, helps me when I'm making adjustments to the compressor. Uh, the next thing I want to do is grab my attack and drag it all the way down and my release all the way down. So now these are set at their fastest settings. 